Hello, and welcome back once again to Infinite Jeff, the project where I, Jeff, read the book Infinite Jest to you one page at a time, one day at a time, ostensibly put it up on YouTube after today, if I can get through four more pages of this and four in er, uh, Jeffinigan's Wakes, I will be caught up, back to one a day for each book, if I can... Um, Yeah, stick to that, not get behind again, which I'm sure I will. It tends to happen on the three on the hundreds because I got to design a new thumbnail, and uh, I usually don't in time, so I end up behind. And then when you get behind, it's like, hey, you're off one day. Okay, I got to read two today. That's okay. That's easy. Three, yeah. but then when you're like the point where it's like, well, to get caught up for today, I'd have to read six, and it's like that's a it's just time. Just, I mean, it's not like I'm not doing... Eh. I have a lot of free time when I'm not at work, but it's not like I want to spend it doing this necessarily. So I like when I can do one a day. Um, yeah, anyway, blah, blah, blah. Who gives a fuck? This is page number 330 of Infinite Jeff. Here we go. Court map to show Lord how to access the uh, end stat calculation that every thousand row... Row... Ronk gens of straight X and gamma produce 6.36 deaths per 100 POP. And for the other 93.64 means reduced lifespans of, in parentheses, total R minus 100, so the radi radius I'm guessing, and then point oh, and then multiply that by point oh th uh, point oh six three six multiplied by total R minus 100 and square, it's an equation. Years. Meaning nobody's exactly going to have a going to be have to be pricing dentures in Minsk, so to speak, in the future, and so on. After about half the planet's extant megatonnage tonnage has been expended, things are looking pretty good for the MNAT crew. Even though they and Sovor are spacexing back and forth with chilling accuracy, Sovor's designated launcher is the butch and suspiciously, suspiciously muscul muscular and kitten plan, who at 12 and a half looks like a Belarusian shot putter and has to buy more urine, buy urine more than quarter annually, and has a way more lush and impressive mustache than, for instance, Hal himself could raise, and who gets these terrible rages. But so Kitten Plans landed nothing worse than an indirect hit all afternoon, while Amnat's launch man is Todd, postal weight, is the nickname, Postlethwaite, an endomorphic 13-year-old from Adena, Minnesota, whose whole infuriating tennis game consists of nothing but kick serves and topspin lobs, and who's been in the Eschaton MV, MVL, footnote 128, for the last two years, and accuracy-wise has to be seen to be believed. Still, both sides have artfully avoided the escalation to sack pop that often takes both super combatants right out of the game. And Amnat's president, Lamont Chu, has used the excuse of Gopnik's emotional strikes against the U.S. South, plus Penn's irrational lobbying at an Israel that is that at the summit was explicitly placed under Amnat's mutual defense umbrella, has used these as golden tactical geese, racking up serious inder points against a South Af and Intpac whose hasty, hasty defensive alliance and shaky aim produced nothing more than a lot of irritated cod off of Gloucester. Wherever, whenever there's a direct hit, Trollsh, Trollsh sits up and gets to use the exclamation he's hit on for a kind of announcer, announce, announcerial trademark. Holy crow! But with Sovor, but Sovor beset from two vectors by Amnat and Erlibsir, whose occasional lob Israel's way Amnat, drawing a storm of diplomatic protests from South Af and Inpac, keeps instructing Lord to log as regrettable mistargetings. Even with cutting-edge civil defense and EMP-resistant communications, poor old Sovor is absorbing such serious collateral, suffder, that it's being in inexorably impelled by game theoretic logic to a position where it's going to pretty much have no choice but to go sack pop against Amnat. Now Sovor Premier Timmy, Sleepy TP, Peterson petitions OP Lord for capacity slash authorization to place a scrambled call to Air Force One. 
Scrambled call means they don't yell at each other publicly across the court's map. Lord has to ferry messages from one side to the other, complete with inclined heads and hushed tones, etc. Premier and President exchange standard formalities. Premier apologizes for the Prince Albert crack. Hal. All right, that was page number 330. This book. big stretch it's been a long day and i am tired i'm cold it's cold in my room right now <sighs> after this i'm gonna go take a shower and warm up but i gotta eat at some point too after i take a shower and eat I'll probably get dopey sleepy and here's the thing it's 3 36 right now uh january 16th 2021 and like I don't want to be in bed till eight, so I really want to be able to be up another four and a half hours, but I have a feeling I'm going to be nodding off in my chair here, so I'm an old fucking man. <sighs> you know, that, that's page 330. I'm going to knock these out, so I want you to have a great night, and I want me to have a great night, too. Good night. Great night.